Today we are going to discuss intervals. An interval measures the distance between two notes. We will first discuss generic intervals, which are measured on the staff. When two notes occupy the same line or space, they are a first apart. C to C is an example of a first. D to D and E to E are also firsts. Any note that shares the same line or the same space is a first. Accidentals are ignored when measuring generic intervals. We'll get to specific intervals later. Only staff position matters. C to C sharp, for example, D to D flat, and A sharp to A flat are all still firsts, even though they sound like different notes. As the notes become further apart on the staff, the interval type increases. C to D, D to E, and E to F are all seconds, for example. Notice how they do not share the same line or the same space. One will be a line while another is a space, and they will be right next to each other. C to E, D to F, and E to G are all thirds. Notice that thirds will always share the same staff position type. Fourths do not share the same staff position type. C to F, D to G, and E to A are all fourths. This pattern is going to continue through fifths, sixths, sevenths, and eighths. You may notice that an eighth repeats the same note name. This is also considered an octave. This chart here puts all of our intervals in order from firsts all the way through eighths. Beyond the octave, you can have ninths, tenths, eleventh, twelfth, thirteenths, and so on. But most commonly, we will use one through eight.